happy na dito tayo sa 213s at kasama natin ang mga ka-happy natin na si Kat, Mel, at si Jones! Thank you, thank you for having me again. What's the agenda for today? Yeah, uh, Jams, gusto lang sana nyo malamin kung anong bago mong hinanda sa ating mga viewers ngayon so that malaman nila kung anong pwede nilang hinanda sa ating nalalapit na Lenten Special or Lenten Season. So, ano nga pala ito, Jams? Pwede mo bang i-introduce sa amin? Ah, uh, yes. We just uh, gumawa lang tayo ng pansit di ho na walang meat. Yun lang naman yun. Walang meat. Eh, you know, even if it is said that uh, sinabi daw ating hope na pwede naman tayo kumain ng meat. Yes, yeah, sinabi niya yan. Eh, hindi naman din masama if we will make at kaya naman natin mag-sacrifice. Habay sa dami ng kasalanan natin. <laughs> hindi lang pagkain ng karne, hindi pa natin kakayanin. True enough, Joms. Joms, actually, I went to Bacoda last year. At parang meron siyang katulad. May nakainan ako actually specific in Silay. Yun yung tinatawag niya restaurant natin na Casa Gamboa. Yes! The yeah. one uh, run by Rina Gamboa. Yes. Yes, that's sila. Yes. Medyo may ano ka sila, Jomsi. Eh, may pagkasimilar. So parang naano ko kung same ba to, na-inspired ka ba dyan sa Casa Gamboa or own version mo to? Ah, no. That is our own version. Although the one in Casa Gamboa, I've tried that too. It's very, very good. Yes. Casa Gamboa serves very good food. Alright, so that's different because if I remember correctly, yung sa Casa Gamboa, it had a uh, puso ng saging. Yes, it has. Yon, that's, but mine is quite different because I added fish and chinin just for color. Actually, John, sinititigang ko pa lang siya nagugutom na ako guys. Actually, legit yan. Sana it is as good as it. Siya ka po, diba, sa Casa Gamboa, parang meron po siyang dinuguan. Ay, hindi po yung dugo. Puso ng sagi. Mm. O sa mga nakakarinig, guys, ha? Magkaibang dinuguan. So, sa puso ng sagi. Susubok gumawa ng pansit na dinuguan. Kung yan ang gusto niya. <laughs> o, oh, narinig niyo yun. Gagawa tayo ng panibagong version ng pansit. Pero bawal Tama, ka Kat? <laughs> At tanong ko lang po, Joms, yung nilagay po ninyong pansit dyan. Ano siya? So, tangot or bihon? Bihon. Hmm, okay. But you can, you can substitute so tangot if that mm. is what you like. So, Joms, actually, ako, as a new, parang ngayon lang to nakita ng mga mata ko eh. Nagtataka ako at ako na, ano ako, nakakurious ako. Kung ikaw ba mismo ay nag-aral under Nora Dasa, Silvia, Silvia Reynoso, if I'm not mistaken, saka, or should I say, nag-aral ka ba abroad cooking? Parang yes, ganyan. Yes, yes. And you know, you study under uh, you know, a legend, for example, like Nora Daza or Silvia Reynoso Gala. You will really learn a lot. But in the end, it's your technique, it's your style. Yes. Yeah, but yes, having had the privilege of studying under this I must say, Joms, kung nag-aral ka under them, it's pretty good na nakikita namin yung mga napag-aralan mo kasi, you know, viewers, makakatulong to. It's a new type of cooking. It's a new version ng pansit lihon. So, better try this one, guys, since malapit na yung London special. So, thank you, Joms, for having a um, good time and for being with us today. So, again, Joms, thank you for... Um, spending your time with us today and for sharing your new um, your new cooking whatever you call this one a new version of bihan guys so it's trying it guys it's a good one so maubos namin to later saka perfect talaga siya pang holy week yes so yun lang guys see you soonest bye, bye.